some of the best news ever is Apple Reminders being integrated inside of the Apple Calendar on iOS 18. I'm currently running iOS 18.1 Beta 2 Developer. Either way, let's have a look at this. All right, so we're going to go in here. Cancel that real quick. You can see I've been messing with it. What's really nice, you can see I have some reminders there, right? Some pay bills. I have a district commander's report that I've got to get taken care of. So on and so forth. Now, how do you do it? Come over here, hit the plus sign. You have the option to enter a calendar event and an option for add a reminder. Now, this is really, really cool here. I want to show you something here. We're going to come back in here. I'm going to scroll up because if you scroll down, you see it gets rid of the keyboard. All right. Next, what you can do here, so you can add to a list that you already have. So whatever reminder you have, whatever list you have going on inside of reminders, you can actually add it to that. Next, the next thing that's really cool, come over here to details. Say someone's messaging you and they basically message you something that is a reminder, you can actually work with it inside of your messaging app. Another amazing thing, you can set a re and you set your reminder and you can also set a location for that reminder, which is awesome. So whenever you get to a certain place and you have notifications turned on, your phone will give you that notification and you're good to go. You can also set priorities. I leave mine on none because if I have a reminder, it's priority high no matter what, right? So to me, my re <laughs> reminder is a reminder, all right? All right, next up I wanted to tell you, you can actually set up early reminder right here so you can actually customize how early you want to be reminded of said reminder this is really neat and let me just make sure i went over everything i wanted to talk about something really fast so as you all know for the longest time on my iphone i've been running the google calendar on the home screen because i needed my google reminders or tasks whatever they call it now inside of the calendar so I could see everything because, I mean, it's not that big of a deal, but I didn't like fiddling between the Apple reminders and the Apple calendar. I wanted to stick in one place. Now we can do that. So say you add a reminder, you just come over here like I was gonna do, I'll add a reminder really quick. Go to son's house, drop off speakers. Come over here, date today. I'll set a custom date. All right, we're going to come over here. All right, time. We're going to set it for, oh, we'll just do it for 1 p.m. We're not going to add it to any list. Add. Boom. So you see right there, it's inside of the calendar. Before, you would not have that. So if you were managing your time throughout the day using Apple Reminders and Apple Calendars, you had to jump in between apps, which, like I said, I mean, if you're in a rush, it's a little ridiculous. And here you can see it added it inside of the reminders app as well when you work inside of the calendar app so you have to i know there's some people that might say it's a little redundant i don't think it really is because because i live inside of my reminders app as well and I, you can see i do have like let me come back over here you see i have like all sorts of different lists i have i operate my youtube out of here i do different things a lot of things inside of my reminders app but back to the whole point is I no longer need to have the Google Calendar front and center on my iPhone. Now, I'm still using Google Calendar. I'm a tech reviewer. I switch devices. So I need to ha be able to, <laughs> I need my Google Calendar. If I'm like on an Android or say I'm on another, another type of computer besides my Mac, I need to be able to access my calendar. And that's how I do it, all right? That's just, that's the nature of the beast when you're a tech reviewer. But anyway, I just wanted to showcase this really quick. It is so awesome. I'm really, really digging the fact that Apple Reminders is now integrated inside of the Apple Calendar app. I mean, to me, it's all about productivity, right? It's all about being efficient, being able to go from one thing to another, one task to another without having to like stutter step, right? This eliminates the stutter step. This is extremely, extremely efficient. Efficient's the word I was looking for. I wanna be efficient whenever I'm conducting business. I don't wanna be like, all right, waiting for this, waiting for that, tapping, tapping, tapping. I wanna go to one spot, handle the business, and including Apple Reminders inside of the Apple Calendar accomplished that goal for me and all of you who are wanting the exact same thing. 
All right, everybody, stay by, stand by or <laughs> stay tuned or subscribe to the channel for more exciting technology Apple news. All right, take care.